Here we have an example um, of, um, it's not an actual patient, but it's uh, more of a, a demo of uh, someone walking with a, a four-pronged walker. And uh, this is of course in the peak mode. If I take it out of peak mode and we just play it, I'll try and fast forward a little bit. You can see the walker now touching the, uh, the strideway and the foot strikes coming on slowly. <clears throat> so if we were to look at this into uh, uh, just a, a force time uh, curve, you might anticipate seeing um, a total force curve where you have the foot strikes, but also the walker would be on there. But, and maybe the walker is not something that you really want to focus in on. So within the software, we can uh, just stop the recording here. Uh, I'll just bring them back into peak so you can see our foot strikes left, right, left, right, and our, our walker here. Now, if we wanted to go in, look at uh, how to isolate the foot strikes, we can go and put on our uh, human tables up here, and it will try and find the left and the right foot, and it shouldn't find the walker. It should just be looking for the shape of the foot. And as you can see here, We've got our left foot in the green boxes and our right foot in the red boxes. And you can see that it successfully um, is uh, uh, isolates the foot strikes from the, the walker itself. And then we can from here go into uh, graph these strikes if we want to look at our force time curves. And we can still see that we've successfully isolated the um, force versus time curves for the right foot and the left. But maybe some of you might be interested in um, understanding maybe what amount of force is being applied to that walker while they're walking. Um, to do this, all you need to do is go up into add a box. And we can just add the box to the same graph one, which is listed here. And you can just pull that box along so that you're covering all of the uh, walker strikes and you'll see down on the bottom of your curve here this blue line will be what uh, will depict the force time curves of the walker um, and of course that's going to be over the entire time of the uh, uh, that the movie was collecting so now you're able to look at the walker strikes with the right foot strike and the green curve, the left foot strike, so that you're able to look at the timing of when that walker is hitting the mat, the amount of force that's being applied to the walker versus um, the, the foot strike, uh, and, and so forth for all of the foot strikes that you've collected on the strideway. And that's essentially um, how you, uh, the software will um, isolate other objects that might be in the, the view uh, while collecting uh, some gate data with some rehab patients.